Hey guys, it's Lori. So today's VLCD2. So was I right on my prediction from yesterday? I'm gonna guess I'm gonna be down two pounds tomorrow. Two pounds, 2.0, two pounds. Yeah, I said I was gonna be down two pounds today. In the beginning of my video yesterday, I said that I was gonna lose all of my load weight, which is which my load weight was 1.8 pounds. That's how much I gained over the weekend of loading. Uh, so what was my weight this morning? I'll put that up right here. Yeah, that was my weight this morning and that is actually, I was wrong, you guys, I was wrong. It's nice and breezy and that breeze feels wonderful. But I was wrong about, about the two pounds. What's going on with my voice? <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, um, I'm actually down. I might have to roll up one of my windows. I'm actually down 3.6, 3.6. I was so happy to see that. Like that just, I, I mean, I, I just feel so much better already because this bloat is coming off. I understand that 3.6 is water weight and I am okay with that because I feel so much better physically and then mentally to see it on the scale, see it dropping like that. That is just, I feel better all the way around. So yeah. I'm just putting my window up really quick. <laughs> I think my phone's probably... Waiting for Perry. Yeah, my Bluetooth paired. <laughs> but that's okay. Anyways, um, what was I saying? <laughs> yeah, I just feel so much better. Like the last couple nights, like last night I felt so comfortable when I got into bed because I wasn't like sick to my stomach and bloated and oh my gosh the two nights before that when I was loading I felt like my stomach was going to explode you guys <laughs> yeah but and even before that because I wasn't eating that great anyway but I was so comfortable last night when I got into bed it was nice <laughs> but yeah um I need to keep that in mind right <laughs> so all my loading foods that I was eating that I didn't finish like those biscuits that I had made if you saw my loading video um i was the only one that ate any of those so i just put the rest in the freezer for i don't know some other time when my kids are there for dinner or something like that i'll just you know pull out a container i put them in two separate containers anyways blah 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 i gave chase some of it too and not the biscuits but some like some chips and some buns and stuff like that um yeah so let me show you guys what i ate yesterday monday very low calorie day number one and my first meal is gonna be actually a little bit of a snack. I'm gonna have some of this peppered beef jerky right here with one of these mini Pepsi Zero, Pepsi Max. I always call them Pepsi Max. I don't know, but it's just one of the mini ones. So that's what I'm gonna have. All right guys, here's dinner for VLCD1. And I'm having some steamed cauliflower and all it has on it is some salt and pepper. And I've got steakums right here with some chopped up poblanos and onions. And I'm gonna have the rest of my little mini Pepsi Max. I hope it's not too flat. It might be, that's okay. I don't really care. I probably won't drink that much of it anyway. I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. I do not give up my half and half ever. So it's not really supposed to be allowed on the protocol, but I do not give it up. I refuse to. And I'm also gonna drink some water. I've been doing real good on my water today. So this is gonna be it. It's gonna be all of my food for the day. So yesterday I wasn't super hungry. I had the beef jerky, um, I don't know, a little while after I got home from work, I had the beef jerky early evening time, like before dinner. And then by like seven o'clock, I think it's, I can't remember exactly what time I ended up eating. It might've been a little bit after that. And I'm fine with that, eating late like that. Um, Cause I'm not hungry during the day. I am just not hungry during the day. It's just natural to me, and the HCG is appetite suppressing anyways, so I'm not going to eat if I'm not hungry. But I, when I did start feeling a little bit of hunger, I decided to eat the beef jerky because I had some other things I wanted to do before I sat down to eat. So I snacked on that, and then I had the, as you saw, the steakums with the poblanos, onions, and some steamed cauliflower. That was really good. Um, yeah, I just love cauliflower, so I have to be careful with that because I can easily overeat cauliflower. <laughs> Um, what else did I want to say? I do like my lipstick. I got this lipstick yesterday and I do like it. 
uh, it's not like super bright in your face kind of lipstick it's a little bit more natural looking and that's what I like and this shirt that I got the the golden colored shirt from Walmart yep I like it got my new flip-flops on I'm pretty happy <laughs> oh and I colored my hair too if you guys I don't know if you can tell or not but I colored my hair uh, it was two days ago yeah it was two days ago and look how straight my hair is right now it's pretty straight I didn't straighten it or anything it just when I colored is my hair sticking up funny right here I think it is <laughs> but anyways when I when I colored it though it just like it softened my hair so much that it just it just went straight I, I just did this with my fingers <laughs> trying to kind of even out the um, the funky that it always gets right here and it worked I'm like wow that's pretty awesome, but I'm trying to do the curly girl method. So like the alcohol free, I'm trying to do like alcohol free products, um, no parabens, sulfate, stuff like that with my shampoo, conditioner and products and stuff. And that has actually really brought out the curl in my hair, but yeah, straight or uh, not straightening it, but, um, coloring it pretty much straightened it. <laughs> But I mean, that's fine. I'm just really not shooting so much for the curl aspect of it as I am just making my hair a little bit healthier. But I do really like this color. It's Acorn by, uh, I think it's the Garnier Nutrice. Is that how you say it? Yeah. I think that's the brand that I used. I'd have to look. I think I still have it in my bathroom trash can. But anyways, yeah, it is definitely Acorn. And if I went to the store, I would I would recognize the box. But I think that was the brand. It's got green and white on it. But anyway, yeah, I really like this color. So I think I'm going to stick with this color for a while. Usually when I color my hair, it's pretty dark and it's kind of drab looking. But I like it. It's, kind, it's just the perfect color. I like it. Um, and usually after, I don't know, two, three, four days, depending on what kind I use if it's a better kind or not my I have red tint to my hair that just starts my hair just starts looking red but anyways yeah nothing against redheads I just you know I like to color it and then when the red starts coming through it looks like it's kind of blotchy you know what I mean but yeah so anyways I'm gonna check back with you guys in a bit all right guys I am tired two jobs done and I'm heading home. I was going to stop at Aldi today and pick up a couple things for the protocol like um, I wanted to get some turkey lunch meat and some carrots. I wanted to get some K-cups because we're about to run out but I don't really need that stuff right now and I am tired. I feel like going home so sometime in the next couple days I'll stop and get that stuff. I just don't feel like it. So anyways yeah. Oh the lipstick. I can't tell. If it, I think it's still on. Hold on. Yep. It's still on. It doesn't rub off. You can't really tell because it's not like shiny anymore. I had lip gloss on, but it's kind of worn off. I'm going to put some more on really quick. Hold on. There's a lot of traffic right here. Okay. I had to pay attention to what I was doing. Not that I'm not now, but yeah. I just had to make sure I was paying extra attention. It still looks just the same as it did this morning so yep anyway <sighs> I'm trying not to make these into like lipstick videos but um oh my prediction that's what the other thing I knew there was something else I was trying to think of I was gonna make my prediction on how much I think I'm gonna be down tomorrow because I'm I think I'm gonna be down tomorrow I better be and let's see I'm gonna say today was 3.6 I'm gonna say 1.4. See if we can make it an even five pounds for my first two days. Okay. Let me know in the comments below what's your prediction? What's your prediction? And yeah, that's gonna be it for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.